When you think about commitment, so who in this room is committed to being a good actor or a great actor? Okay, great. So this is something, did everyone raise their hand? Did anyone miss? A lot, I didn't see your hand up. Oh, okay, I didn't see it. How many of you are committed to being good real estate agents? So there you go, right? So, so, so that always will be your priority. And, and that's what you have to keep in mind if you, take, if you go into real estate, if you, if you go into any other job. There are, by the way, there are waiters who are just waiters. You know that, right? right. You mean they're not all actors? What? Yeah, I mean, mostly, but when you meet someone who's actually a waiter, it's amazing. They're not in California. No, that, that they are. Well, they tend to be at high-end restaurants, mm -hmm. right? And they so know, the they're not, they don't, they don't memorize the specials. That's not where they, like, it'd be, it'd be right. like saying, like, well, did you rehearse for the part? You said, I memorized my lines. You'd say, well, that's not an actor. Like, you just memorize the lines. Where's the preparation? Where's the character? Where's the work? Well, a great waiter is also knows the food, knows the wines, knows what came in that day and what, what would, you know, this one, uh, but I'll tell you that that fish is a little bit dry. I, I would actually suggest you do this, and if you want, I noticed you were drinking that wine, and you're just in great hands. Now, that person isn't prioritizing something else, their acting career over their, their waitering career. They're making a priority of learning food and learning about wine and yeah. learning about culinary history even. So what's your priority? And the reason I ask for your commitment, here's how you measure your commitment. Really simple. What are you willing to give up to get the thing that you're committed to? That's what commitment is. Commitment isn't about what isn't the pot of gold at the end. We're all committed to something amazing that we'd like to be. But commitment is actually measured by how much you're willing to lose to get it. Now, the funny thing is, when you really give yourself over to that, things you thought you were giving up, you didn't even lose. You, know, you thought you were losing relationships, and you end up making tremendous friends on set. You know, you thought you were giving up money and, and you know, constant, and then all of a sudden you start booking jobs and you get some income or you get a, you get a commercial and things start to happen. And, you know, things you think you're giving up, you may not, but you can't approach it that way. Oh, I'm going to pretend to give this up. And, uh, no. What are you willing to lose to have your acting career? 